taking on Jagrup Singh from the Gladiators. With the final introductions, let's go to Jared inside the ring. And now, introducing first, put your hands together for Jagrup Singh! A very confident and comfortable Jagrup Singh makes his way knowing his team has almost secured their place. All he has to do is not get knocked out. Right now, if the Maratha Yodhas can get a TKO, they will level up, which means the Delhi Gladiators will still move on to the finals. All he has to do is not get knocked out and they have secured their place in the finals. And his opponents put your hands together for Sandeep Chikara! The pressure of the world falls on the shoulders of this man, Sandeep Chikara, as he has one opportunity to press the action and look for a KO. If he gets a KO, they will steal it from the Delhi Gladiators. They trail, if they get a TKO, they will draw. And that means the Delhi Gladiators will move on to the finals. But if Sandeep can get a KO, it's the end of the road for the Delhi Gladiators. Here we go to the tail of the tape. Sandeep Chikara for the Yodhas, taking on Jagrup Singh for the Gladiators. Both fighters weighed in approximately the same weight. Huge reach advantage goes to Jagrup Singh. Fighting out of the black corner, he weighed 92 kilograms, representing Delhi Gladiators, Yagrup Singh! His opponent, fighting out of the red corner, he weighed in 98 kilograms, representing Maharaja Yodas, Sandeep! Chikara! Ladies and gentlemen, the this bout is him, Macho! Boxers, keep head up, no low blow, no holding. Touch the gloves, back to the corner. Here we go, final fight of the evening, round number one. Lots of pressure on the Maratha Yodhas. As you can see, the Delhi fans are celebrating. Delhi, all they need to do is survive. Jagrup Singh for the Gladiators, taking on Sandeep Chikara in the white trunks for the Maratha Yodhas. My name is Arjun Chipakati. I'm joined by Jason Solomon. And what a night of fights, my friend. Yo, Delhi, what up? You know what? It's not over till it's over. Four rounds separate Delhi from a clear-cut win. No, definitely. It's still not over. I don't want to get too excited for myself either. Me being a Delhi boy myself, I'm hope I'm happy to see my home team winning. But we still have a lot of time left. One fight left. Maratha Yodhas, they this might is, have a chance to no, get it back. This is a tough order for the Yodhas because all, all uh, Jagrup has to do here is survive. If Chikara gets the KO... Oh! oh wow. Knocked down immediately. Jagrup Singh looking sharp. Wow. He landed a stiff jab. He moving put his away entire jab. body weight into it and he caught Sandeep moving in. And that's Very what nice. made him land the and ground. And Jagrup though coming over the top. Oh! What do on Chikara? Jagrup doesn't want to win by decision. He wants to end this fight. Man, what a stamp it would put on the Delhi Gladiators team if they can win by another knockout. Yeah, he needs definitely. to be careful here though, not get overconfident. Chikara is still tough as they come. Yeah, Singh doesn't want to overshoot and doesn't want to throw everything into his punches right now. We still have a lot of fight left to go. Yep. Um, he should maintain his composure. I mean, I know his team is up. They just had a huge knockout. He just floored him. But we saw what happened in the first fight also between Lokchan and Singh, where Lokchan yeah. was knocked out in the first one, but he came back to win. 
nice so body Singh work. should be careful here. Absolutely. Jagrup has got the initial knockdown, but Chikara is a tough fighter. He seems to be recovered now. He's rallying back. Yeah, he's moving forward now. Is Chikara. You know, I understand the excitement has gotten to Jagrup. His team just came away with a big, big win in the last fight where the birthday boy Gaganpreet came over with that TKO win. They're leading. All they have to do is not lose by knockout and they will move on to the finals. Yeah, that's for sure. But if they get TKO, they might tie. If they tie, Delhi, Delhi still, goes Delhi forward. Delhi still goes yeah. forward based on the points, right? Yep. Delhi's point difference allows them. They have got such a huge point difference that they're comfortable if it goes to a draw. 30 seconds remaining in this opening frame. As good body work by Chikara now. Landing some good shots in the clinch. Yeah, Chikara's doing a good job. He's come back. I think he's, he's shaken off the cobwebs. Yeah, I mean, look, take it from a guy who's been knocked down in the first round of a fight and come back to win. Uh, sometimes getting hit wakes you up. You know what? He just missed with that right hook with Chikara. And uh, Jagrup was already off balance. Yeah, but sometimes, like I was saying, that one now, good round, it's over. Great round, one, two to end the round. And that's definitely Jagrup Singh's round. He got the knockdown. Let's take a look at the highlights now. That was the start to the fight. Both fighters came out aggressively. And he caught him with a good straight left. A beautiful left that sent Chikara tumbling to the mat. Beautiful combinations there. Again, Chikara, though, at the end of the round, rallied back with some good combinations. But Jagrup not giving him any room. He's looking for that finish. Ladies and gentlemen, let's quickly take a look. Introducing Shout for Super Boxing League. Go now to shout.com and shout yes or no to cheer or boo for any of the Super Boxing League fighters and teams. It takes just a few seconds to start shouting. No registration required. All right. Second round, action begins. Round number two. Shikara starts out strong with a big combo. Singh's got a nice tight guard. Nothing really getting through. Ooh, nice right over the top by Singh. Nice combination by both these men here. Jug group looking the sharper, and that's the story so far. Last fight remaining, the Delhi Gladiators, 10 to 6. The Maratha Yodhas need a finisher, a KO, to win this one. Yep, Delhi up 10 to 6 against the Yodhas. And Jug group already, pressing the action here. And Singh has already mm -hmm. dropped Chikara in the first round. Let's see if Chikara can turn it around in the second one here. Both the fighters staying patient here. He, Jagrup can't let Chikara start teeing off on him. Chikara has got a mean right hand. Both fighters taking their time. Oh, big combination by Chikara. Shook up Jagrup there for a moment. Oh, nice combination by Jagrup now, who's looking to close the distance again. Minute 40 seconds remaining in the second frame. As these heavyweights look to throw down, I like how how Jagrup is moving. He's constantly moving around the ring. He's not being a steady. He's not staying a. He's a moving target. And he's moving away from the power hand of Chikara, which is also very important. Moment there, ran into those big punches. Oh, wait a minute. I don't know what that is. He was ducking and. No, no. You Chikara put his head down. I mean, Chikara was pushing down Sig hand and landing some shots, which is illegal. Uh, the ref didn't see it, but the ref did step in and break them anyway, so. Ref doing on top of the action, doing a great job so far. Jagrup and Chikara again with both these men, these heavyweights. It can be lights out when either of them connect. Jagrup again pushing the action. Chikara trying to clinch with him. Yeah, these guys, are, they've, they've become a little less tech. Oh, nice combo. Nice one, too. Jagrup needs to keep his hands up. He doesn't but, want to get caught by Chikara. But what's happening is they're, they're trying to knock each other out, and they just keep swinging and missing and ending up in a clinch. 
Yep, you're right. Nobody's setting it up as we come to a close of All round right. number two. Just 25 seconds. In. Oh! Big right hook by Chikara. Yeah. Chuck Loop might be hurt. Oh, he's hurt. Yeah, he's definitely. hurt for sure. The tides have turned here. Oh, you know what? He needs to hold on for dear life here because right now he is badly hurt. Referee separates them and at an opportune moment because Jagrup is hurt. He got tagged badly by Chikara and Chikara senses it. Jagrup needs to keep his hands up and the round comes to a close. This fight is far from being over, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, you can see he might be hurt still. Look at that good body work by Chikara. Jagrup coming back with some good combinations. But it was the end of that round where Chikara caught him with a straight, with a heavy, heavy right hook. These were some shots which went low. Jagrup was pressing the action till that big right hand that wobbled Jagrup and had him hurt for a moment there. You could see another big right hand by Chikara and this fight is up for grabs. Ladies and gentlemen, we get ready for round number three in this heavyweight division. Two rounds to go. Who will come out on top? Here we go, round number three. Chikara in the white trunks for the Yodhas. Jagrup in the blue. And Jagrup got a little scared there in the last round. Yeah, definitely he was on a little bit of wobbly feet. He did get rocked pretty hard twice actually two straight rights that did the damage oh again Chikara is oh big left hook by Chikara you know what Jagrup should just take it play it safe right now because even if he loses by decision they are safe but if he loses by KO they will be out of the finals yeah he needs to be careful here Singh does oh again, got, caught again. It. got caught again and if he keeps getting caught like this it's gonna be lights out for him and there's and lots of time remaining in this fight there is a lot of time left, but Singh needs to be careful. Chikara is doing a great job. He's got Singh where he wants him. Let's see if Singh can adjust here and change and go back to what he was doing initially in the first round, which ended up allowing him to knock down his opponent. No, I think that was, he just caught Chikara coming in. It's the same thing we saw in, in the first fight where, um, uh, where Rakesh, uh, uh, Sandeep caught Rakesh and he dropped him in the first round. But then Rakesh came back to win the fight. Let's see if that happens here again. To repeat, ladies and gentlemen, if the Gladiators lose by decision, they will still go on. Decision or TKO, they will still go on to the finals. The only way they can lose is by KO. So to say that in a simpler way is that the only way that the Delhi team will not make it to the finals is if the Yodas knock him out completely. Yep. Not a standing eight count, not a technical knockout, but a clean oh. KO knockout. Again, landing a nice one-two is Jug Group. The Same pace certainly has slowed down this part in this round. And oh! Huge right hook! Man, Jug Group is in trouble. Yeah, he, did. he is holding on for dear life there. He did definitely get clean, clean, oh, straight he was landed. Tagged badly. Jug Group is in deep trouble. Yeah, he needs to be careful here. He 40 seconds wanna... remaining in this round. Yeah, he needs just to hold on. on for dear life right now. Oh, he is badly hurt. And the referee trying to split them up. Jug Group is in trouble. He looks up at the clock. He needs to move, keep those hands up. Yeah, he's got because 30 Chikara seconds. Because Chikara is looking to take his head off. Yeah, but he doesn't want to get. <sighs> Excuse me, he doesn't want to oh, get caught up in the down. like that. The referee signaled a knockdown. I don't think so. One second, let's check if he did that. Was that... No. no, no knockdown, sorry, my mistake. A big right hook again. And he's close to a standing eight count here. 20 seconds remaining. Yeah, Chikara is boring on back. the action. Singh is not uh, this is a bad, bad... Oh! Huge shot! Jagrup is badly hurt. And Chikara is pushing the pace. Oh, wow. Yeah, oh, eight man. Count. Man, oh man. Oh wow, Jagrup is having trouble standing up. Yeah, I think this fight's over. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, it's over! And that's a, is that gonna be a knockout? Is or that a TKO? gonna be a knockout or a TKO? Man, Jagrup gets knocked out at the end of round three. But we need to check. 
this, we need to check if that was four points or six points. We're going to take a look at the replay. I don't think he got up. I don't think he got up. If he no, didn't he get didn't up. get up. He did answer the 10 count. So that, that is a clean knockout a then. If he didn't stand if that's up. that's a KO, that means the Yotas have stolen it from the Delhi. Let's see. Let's, it's going to be a... Let's wait for the results and quickly go to break. Let's go to a quick break. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Now, let's quickly go to the decision inside the ring with Jared. Ladies and gentlemen, referee amount should call us up for the fight. In the fourth round, one minute, 59 seconds, by knockout, declaring the winner for Bibara Toyota's Sunday Chikara. Ladies and gentlemen, that means the Maharaja Yodas have upset the Lenny Gladiators 12 points to 10 and they will be going through to the final of the Super Boxing League. Ladies and gentlemen, what a heartbreaker.